What's up? How's it going? Uh, want to give a quick update? On my way to run a little errand. Um, holiday's been pretty crazy with uh, work and all that BS. But um, anyway, at Challenger, I just talked to the dealer. Monday, they're supposed to have me a loaner car. And um, so I can get the synchro fixed. Um, and then I developed, I got a check engine light on my Challenger and um, took it up to my boy's shop, put it on the snap-on tool. So we had a cylinder eight, cylinder number eight misfire. And um, went to clear it out so we could see if, uh, you know, if it did, does it again or whatever. And said something about hooking up to the internet, blah, blah, blah. Well, it turns out you have to have a subscription to Chrysler's network or whatever to, um, to like clear that stuff out and all. What it has is it's got a, uh, let me think what it is here. Oh. It's got a security module, which is on the Challenger, on my Challenger. And 18 and up, most Chrysler vehicles started getting them. I guess in 2015, it got a uh, couple of hackers with a laptop and a Wi-Fi hotspot. Um, they hacked into a Cherokee or something and took control of it. So, I guess naturally, um, Chrysler kind of got upset about it. So, <laughs> it's got a security module. You can either get, it's called a 12 plus 8 adapter. You gotta like either take the screen out to get to that security box. And then, oh, there's another one I think where you can just go into the regular OBD2 port, but then you have to run some wires into the, uh, into a CAN, which is controller area network, to bypass that system in order to clear stuff out. Um, what was that going on? Oh, it's an SGM, Chrysler Secure Gateway Module. Anyway, um. I had been looking at a, what was it called, a Taser from Z Automotive anyway, and um, I had remembered something about a double bypass, so I went back and looked at it, sure enough, it has the bypass system in it, so I'm going to order that, because it'll also unlock some features that other other Chrysler cars have, like uh, it'll unlock the uh, line lock, um, a dash shift light. It also unlocks things like uh, you can have some kind of different like light shows with your lights, on your headlights, tail lights, all that, turn signals. I'm not overly concerned about that, but anyway. So for like 300 bucks, I'll get that. I'll install that, and then that'll allow me to and get in there just normally. Um, also, the uh, my Silverado, the frame's been worse than I thought. So, we were going to, me and a buddy, we were going to try and just basically chain it to a tree and measure and hook up its 15,000 pound winch and try and straighten it redneck style. But uh, I don't want to mess with it. I got a buddy, I'm going to take it to in Austin and uh, put it on an actual frame machine. And uh, I think it'll be money well spent. Anyway, guys, 
I'll catch y'all later. Have a Merry Christmas.